Welcome back, Saints. I'm Colton. And I'm Kira. In national news, the three wildfires in California, Woodsley, Hill, and Camp have finally been contained. The fires have decimated structures and woodland across Southern California. The death toll has risen to 88 and still 203 people missing. We hope to follow up with you in the coming weeks with more information on any missing persons. We'll be having a short show today due to our shortened week last week. In school news, second trimester parking passes are now on sale at the greeter station for $60. Attention seniors, senior shirts are now for sale for $675 and $875. They are on sale until December 21st. In arts news, the SFHS Drama Department has a benefit performance of Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat this weekend. Shows are Saturday at 7 p.m. and Sunday at 2 and 6.30 p.m. SFHS Drama has been honored with an acceptance into the American High School Theater Festival. That means some students will have the opportunity to perform at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival in Scotland this summer. The show will help them raise money for production costs in Scotland, as well as for some local opportunities for members of the Drama Club. The show will also be injunctionated by Hennepin Theater Trust Spotlight Musical Theater Awards, so they have a chance to win some awards at the state level. Tickets are on sale through seatyourself.biz St. Francis High School. Before we go, this week's 5 Minutes of Fame focuses on a student who has already been working on learning about her career path. Morgan Amon has par participated in the Police Explorer program for a number of years. Let's see what reporter Caitlin Riley found out. Student celebrities everywhere, this is why you should care about 5 Minutes of Fame. What does it mean to be a police explorer? Like, what is it? It's, uh, it's basically in the name. It's, uh, pretty much exploring law enforcement. Uh, you're, uh, you do a meeting once a week, and that's on Sunday, and, uh, go over scenarios, um, and that would be, like, domestics, white-collar crime, blue-collar crime. Why did you become a police explorer? Because I'm interested in law enforcement and I wanted to see if uh, law enforcement was a good fit for me. Do you have advice for kids who want to join the police exploring program and who would they would contact? Like for St. Francis, we don't have, uh, our police department doesn't have explorers, so you would go through ANOCA and the way to do that would be uh, you would search up the police department and then like you just search uh, Anoka Police Explorers and then uh, there is contact info on and you can contact those people and ask them to start contacting them in, uh, at the end of August or early uh, September. That's all we have for you for this short week, Saints. Stay tuned for sports. Hey Saints, I'm Nick Pierce and this is sports. Girls hockey played last Tuesday in Buffalo. The Saints played hard but lost to the Bison 5-2. The girls played again on Thursday against the Royals. St. Francis beat Rogers. Boys hockey also played last Tuesday at home against Mark Branch. The Saints destroyed the Vikings 5-2 to, to secure their first win of the season. Girls basketball played a good game against Centennial last Tuesday. Sadly they fell to the Cougars 36-60. They played in Elk River last Thursday against YZ. The Saints suffered a hard loss to the Trojans. Wrestling started off their action against their rivals to the North Cambridge last Thursday. The Saints lost 33-37 to the Blue Jackets in a well-wrestled duel.
That's all for this week. Stay classy, saints.